Hey everyone, in this video, I wanted to show you a Next.js template that we built for developers to get shipping with Firecrawl. So just this week, Google had their IO conference and they announced a ton of different products. So what we wanted to do is build out a Next.js template that leveraged both ImageN4, their latest image generation model, as well as leveraged Gemini 2.5 Flash. So the way that this is gonna work, what we can do is we can grab the URL for the website that we wanna generate an image from. If you are gonna be using the hosted version, all that you need to do is grab the Firecrawl API key, but you can also also run this locally if you're interested. So once you put in your API key, I'm going to go ahead and click save and continue. Now within this, we have three distinct different styles and you can go ahead and build on this generate your own custom styles. We have the Ghibli style, we have Lego and some claymation. Just a few different fun formats on how you can take the context of the website and ultimately generate these image assets that you can use for ideation or inspiration or potentially for good generations, actually posting them as content on social media or what have you. So within here, you have the option to take a look at the different prompts if you're interested. And all that you need to get started is just go ahead and click run. What it will do is it will go and it will gather the website content. In this case, it's gonna be in the format of Markdown. I can click generate prompt. From here, what you'll see is it will think through the prompt. We're leveraging the thinking mode within Gemini 2.5 Flash. We also have the prompt that it generated. We have the style prompt from the previous step. And ultimately what we have here is the final prompt that we're going to be sending to Imagen 4. And what you can also do within here is let's say you want to tweak the style or the content, you can go ahead and edit these text areas before ultimately sending in that prompt to generate the image. So it should only take a number of seconds to generate your image asset. From there, you can go ahead and download the image or click to regenerate an image if you'd like as well. Now, if you're interested in trying this out, you can just grab your Firecrawl API key. You can get a free API key from aistudio.google.com. You can head to foul.ai, get an API key from there. And finally, if you are interested in deploying the application, there's also a quick deploy button that you can find within the readme within the GitHub repository if you want to deploy it directly to Vercel. But otherwise, that's pretty much it for this video. If you have any ideas for any other applications that you'd like to see with Firecrawl, let us know within the comments below. If you found this video useful, please comment, share, and subscribe. Otherwise, until the next one.